everybody, it's Kelsey, and I'm back. <laughs> I hope everyone is enjoying the new year and had good holidays, and I'm sorry I've been away for so long, I was really sick, but I am better now. And today I am going to be making my own lip palette, if you couldn't tell. <laughs> so I picked up a empty lip palette from Viewset, and I am going to depot today, or show you how to make your own. So let's get started. Okay, first things first, you wanna make sure you have your tools. Um, you can use a spatula if you have one, if you do not. Uh, you can use a butter knife, butter knives like I have here. Um, I do have the alcohol prep pads to disinfect those before I start using them. Just anything that you can cut through the lipsticks and have a really nice clean cut would be great. And you want an empty lipstick palette. For my method that I'm using today, I am using the View Set Empty Lip Palettes, and you'll see why later. It is a thicker plastic, it's sturdier, and it won't melt, which is what we need. So I'm going to disinfect, um, and I'll be right back. Okay, next up, now that we are disinfected, you want to take the lipstick, this is my first one that I'm going to use, this is MAC, and this is Sweet Sunrise, it's a really pretty nude, um, this is the lightest nude of all the ones that I have. <laughs> so you want to take your first lipstick and you want to um, push it all the way up there. You can see um, where I've used it at, you want to cut below where I've used it at. So where that line of demarcation is, I am going to use a butter knife and I am going to cut off the top. All right, so as you can see, I cut off the top part and now I'm left with this little nugget right here. I'm going to make another cut right there and then I am going to go ahead and press it into the first slot in my palette. So our first shade is in our palette, and now you're wondering, I'm sure, why I have this mutilated MAC lipstick on the side here. Well, I'm obviously not depotting the whole thing, so I'm going to show you how you can put it back together. So what you need is a candle, believe it or not. Here's my lovely little tea light that I made. <laughs> Don't judge me. Um, so what you are going to do is you are going to take the top of this, hold it over the candle for a second, which is gonna, it actually melts pretty fast, so only for a second. You're gonna melt the top of this and then reattach that top and smooth it out with your fingers. And there you go, your lipstick's back together and you don't have to waste an entire MAC lipstick. All right, and there you have it. Your MAC lipstick is back together. Look at that. Didn't even have to waste it. Is it shorter? Yeah. There's a ton more product in here, though. You actually, if you ever wanted to depot that, you could. But I'm the type of girl who I like to throw my lipsticks in my bag also for my own personal use. So now I can make this for my kit and have my own personal stash. Winning. <laughs> So I'm going to do a couple more colors for you guys, and then I will show you the last step. So here's my first row completed 
and pressed and my little Franken minis are over here. I'm going to pop them into the refrigerator so that they harden back up and I can use them again. And I am going to go ahead and fill the rest. <laughs> All right, so there's my finished product. That second row is all MAC, and that last row is all Dior, except that last one on the right is YSL. So now that these are all pressed, I am going to put this in the microwave. <laughs> um, the view set palette is actually thick enough that it will not melt the plastic in the microwave. Um, you don't have to. You can actually just leave this pressed, but I am OCD and I like the uniform look of it all melted. So I'm going to show you how to put it in the microwave. And there is my finished product. They're all set now. So if you wanted to, you could go ahead and put the stickers on the bottom from the bottom of the tubes, but I am just going to make my own label and uh, go ahead and flip it over and show you guys what it looks like. So pretty. Um, yeah. There you go. Do yourself lipstick palette. The empty palette cost me about 15 bucks. And I almost went and bought the new Anastasia Beverly Hills one for 50 <laughs> Thanks so much for watching, you guys.